Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. Oh boy. So now, time to go back to uh, said Thousand Year Door and see where we're going next. I'm also going to make it my mission. You know the drill. It's becoming tradition. We gotta check on our boy Luigi every single time that we uh, get the opportunity. So I completely forgot where it was again. The uh, thousand year door. I just need to check again. Because I... My brain. Okay, so just a question. If I go in here, this is the uh, pipe room, right? Yep, still so weird how everything appeared here out of nowhere. Yep, it was this way. It was this way, wasn't it? Okay, I'm dumb. It was this way. What is wrong with me? Alright. Here we go. Now, I did hear something that I might actually want to go do, which is, um, you can get a secret party member, apparently, in this game. Here we go. All right. Where to? Ooh, okay. Yep. The way Vivian just hopped up. Better hurry, don't you think? You should go up to the professor's office. You have to let them know about the princess's email. Oh, yeah. Well, what? That was written in the princess in Princess Peach's email. The legendary treasure is actually a spirit of an ancient demon. And those fiends want to use crystal stars to open a thousand year door and resurrect it. You know what's funny that I just thought about? In a hypothetical scenario, what if what if that wasn't Princess Peach? Like how are they so sure it's Princess Peach sending the email? And it's not somebody that's like literally faking uh, being her. How are we supposed to know for sure? You no know, bone chilling. Sadly, it does seem to be consistent with what I've uncovered. Maybe found out, Professor. Mm, it was rather long, so you best listen well. Are right, we ready? And uh, you there, in front of the screen, you listen up too. <laughs> Frick you, bro! Breaking the fourth wall. Frick you, bro! Oh my God! Maybe I'm missing something. Are you talking to no one? Oh, never you mind. Don't worry about the trivial details, just listen. <laughs> oh my god, this game's great. The great cataclysm that destroyed the city, which once stood here, may well refer to this demon. It said that the seven crystal stars were actually created by that monster. And that this thing used the power of the crystal stars to try and control the world. According to legend, the demon was defeated by the end, uh, in the end by four heroes. <laughs> four Swords Adventures! <laughs> Link Cannon! <laughs> Legend, of <laughs> Legend of Zelda Cannon! <laughs> uh, okay. But only the, be only the beast's physical form was destroyed. Its spirit could not be eradicated. But the heroes used the crystal stars, which they had stolen from the demon. And they sealed its wicked spirit within the Palace of Shadow, locked behind the Thousand Year Door. 
From this I gather the crystal stars cannot distinguish good from evil. So if they're all united, they would either seal away or, or resurrect the demon. It seems uh, that who wields the stars determines if they are used for evil or good. Okay. Guess we gotta consider not collecting the crystal stars then. Uh, no. Because, um, <laughs> certain somebody wants to get the rest of them. Does anyone think it might just be better to destroy them once and for all? That was my first thought, too, but for the reasons are just we can't do that. There's a slight possibility that the Thousand Year Door is weakening. It seems the Crystal Stars hold power to seal the beast for a thousand years. So once a thousand years passes, the power to keep the door sealed will sh uh, shut will fail. And unfortunately, this year may be the thousand year. Oh. In other words, we must be ready for the next demon's return. For the, for the demon's return. I'm stupid. I read the other line first. For the demon's return. Uh, even if the X-Nauts fail. Oh, then I guess we better find the rest of the crystal stars if we want to steal a demon, huh? Where do we start? Hmm, according to the map, it appears to be somewhere in Kill Hall Key. Kill Hall Key? I'm so confused. I'm not too familiar with the place, but I've heard of countless and savory rumors. You know, the usual stuff, vengeful spirits, full of hatred, evil curses, things like that. I'm sure the sea salt's down by the harbor no more. Uh, you should head there first to sea salts. Oh, Luigi, are you outside? Oh, Luigi? Luigi? Oh, Luigi, where are you? I want to hear your story. Come on, Luigi. <laughs> Come on, bro. We ain't got all day. Oh, no. Maybe he's at the station? Come on, bro. I want to hear bro yap about more of his plot. Come on. Okay. Guess he's not here, then. Okay, he's not here, then. Massive rip. Found him. Hi. Is this your partner? Is this your partner now? He looks angry. I don't like this. He looks angry. Oh no. Luigi, what did you do this time? <laughs> Luigi, what did you do? What did you do? Well, I had to Circuit Break Island and got me a marvelous compass piece. You don't believe it, bro. Talk about those chills and spills. Pretty exciting, bro. I want to hear about what happened. It's a long story. Luigi, no, what did you do? <laughs> Luigi, your partner looks so angry. Well, like I said, it's a really long story, but here it goes. This is going to become tradition, by the way. We're listening to all the stories whenever he has one. I don't know if that's been made clear by this point. This is our boat arrived at Circuit Break Island. We heard this incredible rocket. We soon found out that they uh, hold cart races almost every day on the island. Whoever takes the first place in the race gets to rule the island as king for that day. No, Vivian's falling asleep too. <laughs> no. Just as we got to the racetrack, uh, they were holding the award ceremony. Couldn't believe my eyes right there on the trophy they gave to the winner. There's another piece of the marvelous compass. It almost passed that away. Doesn't that sound very familiar to a certain situation we were in a couple chapters ago? <laughs> Glitzville, <laughs> Glitzville parallel. <laughs> and so I, I decided right then and there, the only uh, thing to do uh, was enter the next race. Watch it be the fake one. Watch it be a fake piece. I swear to God. I swear if they do that. I mean, I've driven in kart races before, but I thought I'd be a, so I thought I'd be okay. But boy, was I wrong. Yeah, you've driven in a lot of them. 
if, we're, if, if Mario Kart's canon, then yeah. The carts were supercharged machines that could send you airborne with their exhaust. Ooh. These vehicles were armed with missiles and bazookas. It was... Anything goes, bro. Of course, I wanted to get right out of there pronto. These drivers were crazed. But I worked on my courage and signed up anyways. And my, and my race day uh, finally came. One of the best carts, the big green 01. I took my position at the start line. The light went green. I stomped the accelerator. And something bad happened. I was in reverse. The big green went rocketing backwards, me yelling. Crash into the wall behind me, hard enough to cut me off mid scream. Then fell soup. I dropped into the last place and wrecked my racing machine. It wasn't all bad news. The other carts crashed because of my maneuver. Ooh. All the other carts. Once I got in gear and took off, I was the only car left. I went by a country mile, bro. I feel like this is Cap. I feel like this is Cap. I'm just saying. I guess your partner will have something to say about that. Also, why aren't you bringing up your partner, huh? Took the piece off my trophy and added it to the marvelous compass. Compass came to life, pointing me towards a Jezfraz town in the east. And I heard that voice. Princess Claire's voice echoed in my ears again. Oh, my princess, spread up words from poetry, um, if spoken by your voice. Oh, oh, random words would form poetry if spoken by your voice. Oh, no. I most definitely save you. Just wait for me, Princess Eclair. I'm oh, sorry about that, bro. So after that, I got back on my boat. Came back here to Rogueport. And that's what's been up with me. Want to hear about something else? Oh, my God. What does your partner have to say about this? Want to hear what I've been up to? Just come find me, okay? I'll be around. Oh my god, here we go. Look at his eyes, you can tell bro is angry. What do you keep doing, Luigi? Luigi, all of your partners hate you. What happened? I literally befriended somebody that was on the enemy team. How are you doing this, man? I literally befriended Vivian, of all people. Come on. Yeah, I'm Torque. And I don't... Uh... Uh... Eh. And don't... Bro, my brain. And don't for a second think this dude's telling the whole story. The reason I landed my rig was because he got down on his knees and begged. Rig? And what happens? He's in it for one second before he completely totals it. Idiot. And it let him just dip out of my sight so he repays me the 5,000 coin repair costs. Oh my god, bro. They all hate. Can he please get a single partner that likes him? Please. I, I really hope one of his partners actually cares. Please. Oh my god, bro. This poor guy just never gets a break. Jesus. That is wild. Oh. Oh, can I just leave? No. Oh, wait, you. you must have. What's with the stink guy, eh? You guys want to say? I didn't ask me anything. Like an encyclopedia. I am. I can't answer anything. Oh, you know, key. Listen, mate. Don't ask me about that place. I no need for a curse from the pirate kit. Oh, boy. Here we go. That ship doctor? Uh, she belongs to Flavi uh, Flavio. Uh, the merchant trader. You don't sail too often, though. Mostly hangs out at joint, uh, the inn by the square. Hi. Dude, this guy looks sick. I love this guy. What? I love this design. Yo. No matter how much I work, life never gets any easier uh, for me. You know what I mean? This got to be... Uh, this got to be way to just go poof. Uh, and get rich, you know? Poof. Bro, this guy right here is giving off, like, partner vibes. I wonder... Mmm, I wonder, could he be a partner? He's given I don't know, he's given off massive, like... Mmm, I don't know. I think, 
Oh no, wait, I think there is another bob -omb you get in this game, but I don't... Oh god, I don't remember what he looks like. Wait. <laughs> oh no. Interesting, I wonder. So that ship belongs to the guy that hangs out around the um, place Luigi's in, right? Is that pirate guy the gem? Yep, it is. And what do you want, huh? Who, me, you ask about? Oh, I am called Flavio. I am, how you say, a traitor, the richest man of Rogueport. Monetary wealth gives me freedom. Yes, the freedom gives me wealth of spirit. And yet, why is uh, that man whose life is unchained? Uh, must always long for yet more, huh? What is missing from my life? These tears, uh, this tears at my very inside. Uh, I must know. What do I lack? Probably thrills. Hmm. Thrills, you say, ah. I suppose one does need some thrills every now and then. There's nothing like the feeling of being alone on a mountain, shivering to death. What? Ah, no. Foolish love you. That chills, you, you silly man. What I need are thrills. Oh my god. It holds horses, that's it. I don't think about it. I once heard of this treasure of uh, the treasure of Cortez. Uh, the Pirate King. Yes, the answer. Oh, such happiness for me. Uh, a hunt for pirate treasure. Why, that shrieks of romance, and thrills, and emotion, and even money. Where does the romance come in? Do you not know the tale? The Pirate King's treasure. In the, on key, all key. Ah, well, tales say uh, that the pirate king Cortez, his horde of pirate uh, booty there, for years, treasure hunters and ruffians have gone there and searched the loot. But not a single one of them has ever returned. Oh, the horror makes uh, my back tingle. People here whisper that the ghosts of Cortez attacks always seek his treasure. Eek. <laughs> the eek. But it's because of, of those very rumors that people no longer go to Kiel Key. Do not stop Flavio, that treasure is there, yes, and I'm going to prove it. I am Flavio. Uh, traitor extraordinaire, millionaire sailor of the seven seas. <laughs> yeah, for real, my honest reaction, Mario. What was that you were saying? Lock of a legendary treasure, you're beneath Rogue Force. Why talk such craziness? There isn't anything like that. Uh, this dull armpit of a town. You'd not be believing each stupid rumor about treasure. Some street merchant spews out. No, 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 no. What madness comes bursting from your mouth? You have a treasure map. Well, hand it over, brother. I mean, show me. You have a good joke on me. Spab leads straight to Key Hall Key. You swine. You just steal my treasure out of a bunch of me. You awful, awful man. Now I'm confused. You were looking for things known as crystal stars. But now that I'm thinking, star-shaped stone was said to be in Cortez Island, in Cortez Ford. Perhaps if I sell it for a staggering amount of cash. Yes, that would be it. I saw up such sauce, Flavio. He needs romance, thrills, and emotion. I cannot ignore what this uh, business before me suggests. This must be fate at work. I guess I'll go with you to key all key. Because crystal star is yours, yes, but the rest of the treasure is mine. Absolutely. Huh? Let's repeat that. Well, let's use our plug. You have no ship. Ha 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 ha! Unfortunate foolish man. You do not know who I am. I will have a ship ready in no time. And it will be massive and glorious. Splendid, splendid, splendid. Let's begin preparations immediately, shall we? I volunteer myself as our uh, intrepid uh, leader. Yes. Uh, and you will be captain. Uh, danger, miss. Uh, danger and adventure to the white nostrils. Go to the harbor right away. Interesting. I 
I really, really hope that Luigi's plot ends with, like, something good. I really hope it's not going to end with, wow, we finally got her back, but actually, Luigi accidentally got an entire town nuked by, like, some, like, I don't know, like, accidentally gets the entire, like, town nuked or something, like, nah. Oh, this guy is with us. Ooh, okay. Um, 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 <laughs> um, 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 uh, uh, to the right, to the right, um, uh, oh no, oh no, oh, we're screwed. And so, Zia, well, sadly, it's like problems seem to have popped up. But if you see eyes on us, that registered fantastic ship. She is a fine vessel, though. It's says SS Flavia, the queen of the countless ships in my personal fleet. The Rob, uh, Majesty of her hull, the pomp, uh, and circumstance. Uh, none can compare to her. Ah, uh, behold the elegant curve of her prow. She got, uh, very soul, don't you agree? She's not just a beauty, she's a savage beast in the water, her tops and bogs, sailboats. Above all, I can tell you this proud ship can. I guess, did you speak? Yes, yeah, well, of course. The problem is that, uh, oh yeah, the problem that has sprung up. You've only forgotten about it. That's Flavia. She bewitches me. So here's the issue. We have no navigator. He ran off. Uh, he ran off the dog. Navigator, of course, is the highest ring helmsman. You see a ship, see now? And here's the real problem. The waters around Kiel Key are deathly dangerous. We need an absurdly skilled helmsman for a navigator. Uh, it is a, how you say, a pickle. Oi, Flavia. You're talking there, sir. If you know what I'm saying, I might have a solution. And tease me, Papatch. Uh, you can have, you can solve our problem. Spit it out already, <laughs> sir. I heard talk of a fame no, a legendary sailor living in Rogue Port. The thing is called Admiral Bobbery. Oh, that's who we're looking for. That's probably our next partner. Salty old sea dog, by all accounts. He said to have to have the helmsman's touch, sir. To make any ship bow to his will. Thing is, there ain't a soul uh, what's seen him uh, on the seas of late. Oh, so boom, problem solved. Let us scout this Bobbery fellow and get him on a board. I think I remember where he is. As customary, uh, my captain will handle all negotiations. That would be you, Mario. It does sound fair to everyone, does it not? In place, aye, sir. Hey, sounds fair, sir. On board, good plan. Sure thing. Oh no. It is decided. Let's find his Bobbery and bring him here. The fortune sails with you. No, 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 no. Hey, oh yes, I am gonna be filthy rich. I can't wait to leave this port. You listen. Oh, pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet um, your acquaintance, be he. What are a Bobbery? No, 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 no. No, 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 Mario, you are not dumb. Mario, he is right. Mario, Mario, please, we are not seriously doing this right now. Please, there's no way you can't tell. No, 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 we are not seriously doing this, are we? No, are you dumb? Mario, why? Nope, hold on. Nope, I have the solution. The ultimate solution. Screw you. Nope, 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 nope. Screw you. They call it Guy Four Eyes. He's one of the sailors coming with us to Key Alki. I totally feel like I've seen him somewhere before, though. Maybe I'm just losing it. No, 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 Goombella. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Come on, please. Oh, God. We are so screwed. Oh, we are so screwed. Oh, God. Well, I know where to find that guy. I think I remember what he looks like now. This is unfortunately what happens when you have, like, some level of spoilers in your head. I mean, for God's sakes, he's on the box art, to be fair. He is on the box art. Oh, right, so now it's gonna put in um, Creepy Steeple, I guess? Or the town? 
Yep. Cool. I remember where he is. I remember exactly where he is. Where are you? Is that you? Hut, I'm General White. I am a bum. I've lost my hopes and dreams. I don't care what I do. Just want to help people. Is that so wrong? Wait, are you serious? Wait, you aren't gonna help? Wouldn't you know him? I should not write the bomb. I guess white bombs are pretty rare. It's cool mustache too, you might even give your lip fuzz if you run uh, for his money. Ah, oh, okay. Can I listen to him yap if I like? Nope, okay. Never mind, I just realized that wasn't him as well. That can't be him. Oh, wait, 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 just saw that. Almost forgot there was that spot here. Mega Rush P badge. Increase power by five, and your partner only has one HP left. Ooh. Never mind, I guess. I thought that would have been him, but no. I guess he just exists. He has to be important in some way, shape, or form, correct? Surely he has to be important. I wonder where Bobber is. That lots of rumors flow through Podley's place. Yep. Bob bomb blowing up is like throwing a punch for an ordinary bloke. You want to leave the biggest impression? You gotta do it with perfect timing. Mom said that once you learn that timing, you're finally an adult with bomb. Aw, oh, Mom. I forgot that paper bombs don't actually, like, die when they explode. I keep forgetting about that. I Means scram! Don't talk to me. Heart's burning for a long lost love. Oh my god. This becomes extraordinary beauty at the shoe shop in Glitzville. You know how many times I flirted? She never pays me the slightest attention. L, I guess. <laughs> Emerald Bobbery. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. You know that house just past the wall, the eastern part of town? That's his. I think both you and he would be better off if you just let him be. Huh. There is that big chest I just noticed is above that building. I don't know how we're supposed to get there, though. Okay then. All oh, right. Oh god, what is this curse? Oh lord. Hey, it's a mustache. You remember me, right? I appeared a thief. I'd be straight here. He should have told me to wash my hands with thievery. So I can't be a jealous. I can't be a thief. What should I do, you think? Do I have no talents? Ah, that's funny. Wait, so now what do I do?
Right! Oh my god, I'm dumb. I forgot. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Quinn. I completely forgot about you. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is wrong with me? Okay. Quinn, get out here. Oh. There we go. And on top, too. Wait a minute, what? How in the world do you expect us to get on top? Okay, how do I get on top? How in the world do I do that? Oh, I'm dumb. I am so... Okay. Wow. Hi. The other day I saw this guy jumping from the roof. Man, he was so dashing. You know, actually, it might have been a bandit. Yeah, that's why he was sneaking into chimneys. Oh, no. Santa? Real? No way. Wait, idea. Idea. Big brain. No? The box? Are you sure? Nope. Okay. Quinn. Is this his house then? Give me that. As a matter of fact, let's start upgrading our teammates actually. Now, nah, hold on. I'm gonna get sidetracked here. Uh, you can power up. Uh, one of your partners for three shine sprites. Hold, hold. Which partner would you like me to power up? Ooh, attack all foes with fire. Bet. So, Zubi. Very real magic lines, by the way. Can I power up more? Yep. Shell shield sounds cool. Interesting, all right. Replenish HP. Sure. I'm not gonna upgrade Quinn as well, because I wanna wait till we get another partner.
Nope, I'm good for now. Already did. Okay, hold on. No, uh, I already did. What? Small opening. Oh my god, I'm stupid. Wait, I'm stupid. Why would I... Oh my god. Okay. That's my bad, guys. What do you blokes want? Oh boy. Here we go. Admiral Bobbery. I the faintest idea what you're talking about. Now if you please. Please don't insult us, we already know you the Admiral, so just admit it. Huh. What a poppycock. Tell, uh, tell me what you'd want with me uh, if I were this chap. Say so your ship needs a navigator and you want me to do the job, hmm? I'm sorry, we have to look elsewhere. I just have to sail upon the sea. Nevermore. But maybe you don't understand how important this is. We need you. But you will never get to key all key. At least, uh, sorry to you fellows. When I say no, what I mean is no. Now away with you. Uh. See, we're gone. Goodbye. Okay, you're not falling for that. What do you think, Wire? Nothing we say seems to convince this man. Can you find it odd? Why would a sailor have such a hatred for the sea? We need answers. Maybe we should ask around town about this man's story. <laughs> so we'll see you all the time usually. But now, where is he today? I think I come talk to him about a way to make some quick dough. Just need to tell him that I'm looking for him, okay? Oh, okay. I've got a question about something. I tend to ask that frankly guy. He's a poor professor, so he knows a lot of junk. We need help with anything to ask. Oh, okay. Wait. No, good idea. Good idea. He'll probably know. I'm a Bobber. He won't go to sea. That's a setback. I don't know the man myself, so I don't know what to tell you, unfortunately. I'd be willing to bet that Podley knows a thing or two. Ooh, okay. Thank you very much, random Goomba walking around. You helped more than you'd think. See, Bob, we won't go to sea, huh? Uh, well, I can't say it surprises me. The real question is, are you folks really sure you want Bobby back on the water? Uh, oh, is that it? Nice. No, you want him out for an expedition to Key Alki. If he's uh, out there, most sailors will meet their ends. Not old Bobby, though. The fact of the matter is, Edmund Bobby's tale is sad. Horribly sad, actually. I'll probably end up crying. But I'll tell it to you. Well,. Oh, you really want me to? No, I hate sad stories! <laughs> In that case, get ready. Barbary's tale of woe goes something like this. Barbary Bob was once married. Had a wife of enduring beauty named uh, Scarlet. Uh, the two of them were uh, madly in love. Sort of love reversed for fairy tales. Uh, not, no, reserved for fairy tales. My bad. Now, Bobbery was a, re a renowned sailor, so he was just away from home for long periods. Scarlet never complained, though, and always waited faithfully for Bobbery's return. And Bobbery, as I never drifted, he loved only Scarlet, truly and deeply. So they lived and found happiness where they could. 
Not was good for a time. I have a bad feeling. Oh boy. Not all good things can last. It was a particularly icy winter when it happened. God, it felt ill. The virus, the passing cold, no one knew. But, it's, but it soon turned serious. Aubrey at sea, on a long, lonely voyage, knew nothing of his bride's suffering. During the return, Scarlet has to come. She was gone. Bro. Aubrey, of course, blamed himself. My loving wife perished because of me. If I were not at sea, I could have uh, nourished her to health. I could have saved her. He was so overcome with such thoughts. They tormented him always, haunting his sleep. He's never gone out to sea since. I can't imagine what a poor man went through. No wonder he won't sail. No one knows till now, so tell me. Bro, is this actually a choice? I hate when they do this because it makes me feel like they're giving me a choice, but at the same time, I feel like it's just going to make me sit through all this dialogue again if I press no. You gotta remember, though, we are talking the fate of the world, though. We do have to remember that part now, that the Thousand Year Door will reopen. We can't just not go there. We need that crystal star, or everybody dies. Um, uh, yeah. Here, well, I understand. If you're that determined, then I'll give you this. Old letter. A letter Scarlet wrote to Bobbery just before she departed. What? On her deathbed, Scarlet wrote Bobri a final letter. You hold it in your hands. I don't know what's written inside, but I can tell you what she told me as she lay dying. If I should succumb to this plague, if my love should blame himself for my death, give him this letter to him so he may hear my voice. It was her last request. I saw Bobri in misery, trying to forget the pain as you mourn his wife. Sorry, I had to pause for a second there. I just couldn't bring myself to present this letter to him. I've regretted it ever since. Please. Take this letter and do the deed I was too cowardly to do. Take it to Bobbery. Thanks so much, Podly. We'll deliver the letter, don't you worry. Ready, Mario? Dang, bro. Okay, this this guy's gonna have all oh, I feel like this guy's gonna be that one character everybody feels for. What I feel like that's gonna be like this is gonna be that character, like the one that everybody like talks about a lot online like when i actually start looking up stuff about this game properly once i beat it i have a feeling it's gonna be that one character that everybody like discusses his backstory with uh frick bro here you go man what oh blower the beard not you again but how many times you hear me my stance is firm now away with you pardon our letter you say for me what? Scarlet? This is Scarlet's handwriting. Scarlet, my love. Oh boy, here we go. My love, if you're reading this letter, then I'm no longer by your side. It's fate has stepped between us. I've decided to write you this letter. If you're reading this, I must have passed away while you were at sea. You only assume that you will blame yourself for it, sweet Bobbery. Although my life was short, you gave me more than a lifetime's worth of joy. Though you will mourn, I beg that you re remember that time. Like love is a tide. You were one with the sea, as you were one with me. Do not lose both your lives. Uh, loves. Time with this love is a tide. You were one with the sea, as you were one with me. A thousand pardons, but... May I have a moment alone, if you please, bro? I love I was happy, Mr. Scarlet. I love you still. Dang, bro, the way Mario did that, just like, yeah. And then, you're looking for a navigator, I believe? I'm for Kialki. Oh, yeah. If you think an old sea bomb like me is what you need, then let's shove off. Well, Bobbery, wonderful. My ship's in the harbor, hmm? 
Where's the Spectre before we leave? I shall meet you there. Dang. That is crazy, man. Bro, it's so sa Once again, I just love when freaking... I, I, this is something I will definitely love about Paper Mario games. They aren't afraid to delve into topics like death. They aren't afraid to do it. Oh, it's Petunia. Hold on. How do I check that again? Yep. Hey, Mario. How are you? I'm, uh, good. No, very good. No, great. Lots of stuff has changed here. Oh, but not the Elder being mad at my brother. That's still the same. I do wish you would, uh, come back to play sometime. You're really busy? Going someplace far away? Like a place nobody's ever been? Wow, that'd be fun. I'm jealous. If you have time, come back here. Uh, come play with me, okay? You have to promise. You're a petunie. Aww. This game is so great, man. I, s I think I finally understand all of the hype. I, I really think I finally get it. This game really doesn't hold back, does it? Man. <laughs> I need to get Bob re on board, you wonderful mustache man, you. To you, I must say ahoy. I was wise to choose, as cap to choose you as a captain. Ahoy to me as well. We have already loaded our cargo on supplies. Yes, preparations are complete. We have no errands. We should depart at once. What do you say? Shall we set sail? I'm trying to think of just anything I do have to do. Ooh, I guess the question is, do I want to get that partner? Frick, bro. Let's just go. I'll have to get that partner afterwards. Very well, to the sea. Raise anchor and set sails for bills and emotion. And romance and money. The destination is Dread Key Hold Key. Wait up! Uh oh. Oh. Oh, he went with us. That one but bomb was scared to go, right? It's X not one here. Come in, dude. I repeat, X not one here. Over. Hard to write. Reading you by f uh you five by filtration is successful. X not uh black board vessel. Bro, frick you. Mo well, we knew from the very beginning that was an X not. Don't even. Repeat, X not black is off board the vessel. The key to uh, pirates. Okay, the key to pirates. Hold on a second. Um. Okay, month star day exo over the protest of my crew. The Slavian has set sail. Is this voyage as reckless as they say? I must scoff. Lavia will show them guts. Another uh, day of good wind. White clouds, they dazzling. It is as if they are a bless or a blessing our voyage. Lavia thanks them most heartfully. Oh boy. This is taking a hot minute. Month star day X music note. Things are going smoothly, perhaps even too smoothly for my comfort. At a speed we should reach our destination by tomorrow's sunrise. We're not. Yep. Do not hold that out in the open. What are a feeling that X Naught's about to steal it from you, bro? I wonder, is everybody going to start singing along? It's called Captain Cascades, with Jewel Shines Plays, Smooth Must Moon Festival, whatever. Stash Brothers Best Friends, 
three times red stash lands on his end. Red stash belly four times wax, so let's hear his fireworks go boom. That's a boom boss a boom festival. Okay. It's now we're talking. Bobby I told you. Do you not? Nothing to fear now. Lands right before our eyes. Do you see it? It is about enough treasure. Oh ho, I feel fabulous. Shall I uh, tell you one of my many tales of raw bravery? No, it's not. No, it's no trouble at all. There was shocked and deadly uh, combat with the sea serpent. Yes, but even then I smiled, for I knew I'd prevail. Great, he started again. A tale of bravery, right? I heard this one yesterday. So we're to escape to, we just listen until he's finished. Even now, you know. You take him, yes. Uh, er. Where was I? Oh, yes, yes. Yes, but even I, then I spent. Oh, my, I just repeated himself. Oh, no. Just gonna keep going. If you interrupt him mid story, he absolutely loses it, too. Uh, why is the what? What's going on here? The ship's stopping. I must love you. Awful sorry to interrupt your broken story. The ship stopped. Ah, uh, stop to say to me after interrupting a story of passion and fury. Well, it was your job to keep the ship moving, yes, and to take care of it. I may see no issue with the ship itself, and I assure you, I'm not so I'm not so rusty a sailor that I would miss it. Investigate, uh, right quick. Wait a tick. What? Oh. Yeah, I'm working on it. Just wait a good with some moment, scallywags. Oh boy. This is why nobody makes it. I quit shoving now, I'm working over here. Say so quit shoving. Uh ah mm, there here. Let's work us now. Who's here? Someone tell me what's going on? No, they're upon us. Pirate ghosts. All the rumors were true. Uh, what do we do? We gotta get out of here. Ah. Uh, don't panic yourself. It's just a dream. We are all having. We are all having a wake. Now, quickly, move the boat. Ooh, oh god. Oh, pursuing thing. Are you really Savage Pirate King? Hey, help me! Hope now everyone remains civilized. Relax, don't panic. Actually, I relax, I say. You simply must take it easier. What? Oh, great. Bobbery, no! Excuse me, listen, everyone. If we could form an orderly line without shoving right after. L. Whoa. Hey, we must get out of here. Abandoned ship. Every rich marvelous butcher for himself. Okay, month star, day X star. What's from disaster? I kindly see it washes ashore. A strange irony, this island, Kiel Key. It's our intended destination all along now. Ooh, we made it to the island? Yeah, we mourn. We lost three crew members, including Admiral Bobbery. No, bro. He's been thinking that they were taken by the Pirate King. That ghostly thing. What happened to us now, huh? We must be lost without hope. Stricken in the wilds. Monstar, star, day X heart. We have made a semblance of civilized life here. The ship's float stem, uh, washed in. Now we have, uh, salty bread and other salty things. 
We can live for some time on this uh, salty bounty of the sea. Then, would I ask? On day zero, zero. Okay. Er, circle, circle. We have built a few huts from the washed up timbers. Our poor sweet SS Flavion. At least the shanties keep out the wind and rain. Or shanties, I don't know. We still have had no sign of Barbary and the others. In my heart, she doubts. So, despite my fears, we must continue to hope that they are alive somewhere. On star, X, uh, day, zero, X. Or, sorry, circle X. Three days of the aisle, though, and the huts are all finished. We've carved a life out here. We all dream of return to our port. Wait, Captain Stash. Ain't much. We finished a wee hut for you to rest in. Come have a look. Okay, so we've been here for a hot minute. Okay. I really hope Admiral Barbary is okay, bro. I really hope he's okay. He does not deserve more garbage after all the other garbage he's went through. Gavin, please help. Flavio and Papatra in a huge fight. Okay, I thought that he was stuttering when he said his name. It really is Papatch. Got it. What about you, uh, Squinty? You turned to jelly when you saw those ghosts. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? You're the one, uh, quaking in its boots, fancy pants. Hey, wait one minute. Did you just call the great Flavio Fancy Pants? That's right, Fancy Pants. Fancy Pants, Fancy Pants, Fancy Pants. Oh my god. Oh, you little Cyclops. Flavio demands satisfaction. Uh, you beat hammers. At dawn. Oh, that's right, fine with me. I can't wait to put a few dents in those fancy threads. Oh boy. They're here! Empty stash. Ghosts are back. Mario, front center. This is an order. Take care of those ghosts. Oh, God. Oh, they actually burn us. I did not think they were actually fire. Okay. Oh, what? They multiply. Ow, okay. Wow, okay. Oh boy. What's this? Oh. Okay, interesting. I don't know if that one's really that good. Wait, has that been restoring their health? Oh god, I think I've been restoring their health. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, you know what we gotta do? Actually, wait, no.
have a life buffer there. Oh wait, was that supposed to revive? I'm dumb. Oh great. Whatever. Um, appeal. I tried to do a super... Let's go. Please. You're smoked. Nope, you're all smoked. Goodbye. Y'all are cooked. There you go. Y'all are dead. Great. Okay. Oh god. Vivian's dead. Vivian's dead. Oh, no, that's FP. Um, No, okay. They might actually end up killing us. Oh god. Are you joking? First of all, okay, embers are uh, sort of a pale blue flame spirit, kind of spooky. Ice HP is eight attacks, three and defense is zero. Or since this thing is a flame, touching it will hurt. I want to teach you that. Oh great! <laughs> Here's another thing you should know: something horrible is likely to happen if you attack it with fire. Looks like it's susceptible to ice or explosive attacks, though. Is that something? Yeah, hit by a flame attack. You'll catch fire. I should try to guard well. Oh god. Let's go. Oh my god. What? What? Why? That doesn't make sense, though. Isn't that sp? Bro, what? Isn't that supposed to be like... Okay, I'm not even gonna... Okay. How do I survive this? I know how. I'm gonna have to be very, very smart about this one. Oh god, the fact I'm close to dying to these things is crazy. 
Oh god, okay. Come on, Goombello, make it through. Oh god. Oh, she's dead. Oh no, this might ruin the whole plan. Oh my god, this ruins the whole plan. Please let me use you. Oh, thank god. Oh no. You are joking. Um, okay, we're screwed. I just lost. Oh no. Or not. Can I super guard them? There we go. You all are literally flames. This should literally put you out. No, are you- Oh god. Oh wait, it still worked. Or barely worked, never mind. Can I just hammer you, please? There we go. Oh my god, that was close. What even happened? It's probably because I was using Vivian to try and kill them. That's probably what happened. Yes, you're a blue and beast, Captain Stash. Too early to celebrate, no? There's surely more of them elsewhere, huh? So I must investigate the rest of the island. Yes, that uh, is what must be. Peter's expedition. I, of course, should stay here on this uh, brook. No argument. Of course. Of course. You would not, wouldn't do anything. You just want treasure, bro. So, of course, Mario, perhaps you could handle the exploration of silent. Can do. So, boy, I knew you would go forth uh, with boldness. We count upon you. How do I heal? Oh, what's going to happen to all of us? Bro, my health! What do I do about my health, guys? Oh. Okay, yep. I did not mean to do that. Okay, nope, we're going in here. Hi, this may not look like much. We're very proud of our seaside shanty. Night stays to- are you joking? Didn't we build this? Sleep tight. You're making your own captain pay, that's crazy. You sleep well, captain? Enjoy your stay. Okay then. Well, um... What an episode, huh? Alright, so I cannot believe I almost just died to that. That is crazy. Why do I see, like, a dark Bowser in the back? What? Whatever. But, uh, yeah. That being said, uh, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Uh, we are, like, ten minutes over. I don't even know how that happened. That boss fights... Well, not boss, but that fight there just screwed me. Oh, my God. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.